The next demonstration will be using the soft cast, the resilient material for the treatment of what would be a grade two sprained ankle, so partial tearing of the lateral ligaments of the ankle. This wrap would allow a person involved in athletics to actually participate with this wrap or for just a person doing normal daily activities it would allow them to walk without crutches or by just a, uh, putting on a normal athletic shoe over the wrap. So the way this one is applied is over one layer of stockinette with some selected um, areas that will be padded just for abrasion purposes. So the stockinette will be applied over the foot and ankle and the ultimate cast will extend just about six or eight inches above the malelar area. Again, we've rolled the, the stockinette for ease of application. And the way that we remove the wrinkles across the ankle is by making a simple cut in the stockinette and taking our scissors and just making a cut from heel to heel and overlapping the stockinette so that we've removed any wrinkles underneath the stockinette. For padding, we're going to use, in this case, what's called microfoam tape. It's a, it's a rubbery, stretchy material that will provide padding and we're going to place a piece of this over the medial and lateral malelar areas. Because it's a tape, it will stick to the padding and will not migrate underneath the material. The other area that we need to protect is the dorsum. So one piece there. And then the last area of protection will be over the Achilles. So now we have the ankle prepared. As before, gloves are used for the application of the soft cast. And we will dip this in water because it's a very rapid wrapping technique. So we're going to start wrapping at the metatarsal heads and we're going to continue up and then when we come back, I'm going to alert you that we're going to do a heel lock on both sides of the ankle for stability. So now we'll wet the material. Then as we come back down the ankle, we're coming around and we'll do a heel lock on the lateral side and then a heel lock on the medial side and then we'll come around and cover both heel locks and then one last figure of eight with the remaining material. So as you can see, it's a very quick and easy application technique for wrapping. And now we'll just mold and make sure that we maintain 90 degrees 
of dorsiflexion, plantar flexion, and neutral inversion, eversion, molding around the Achilles area and malleolar area and arch. When this material is set, and the setting profile is the same with this as with um, the rigid materials, it will be set in the three to four minute range and then reach functional strength in 20 minutes. You can see the material itself naturally conforms to the ankle. So we've reached our, our setting time and the trimming of this material, because it's resilient and the edges will not um, cause any abrasion or um, digging in to the patient, we can just trim with our scissors. And we don't need to roll the stockinette back and capture it in the material. That just creates bulk under the shoe. So this allows for minimizing bulk under the athletic shoe. And we can do the same proximally. Now when the patient's ready to resume normal activities, all they have to do is put their athletic sock over the wrap and insert this in their shoe. So as you can see, it's a quick um, way of allowing return to normal activities, even athletics, um, for um, partial tearing of the lateral ligaments. Now you can see as we're ready to um, ambulate that the patient has flexion capabilities and normal gait opportunities. For removing the soft cast ankle wrap, there are two ways it can be removed. You can find the end and simply unwrap the material until it's off, or you can simply use your scissors and cut So you can see the ankle wrap in terms of the molding and the conformability around the Achilles area.